So we are all waiting in anticipation for Logan Paul's big response to CoffeeZilla's trilogy. But CoffeeZilla and Logan Paul themselves have been going at each other on Twitter. It seems the anticipation is growing, the tension is rising, and shit is about to hit the fan. This all started on Twitter when Logan Paul teased his response video with this picture with a coffee cup emoji and a cap emoji. And he's dressed up, clearly, as CoffeeZilla. Clearly, Logan Paul is his number one fucking fan. The green screen behind him too, assuming Logan Paul is going to do some, like, parody of CoffeeZilla to try and come back at him. Straight away, in my mind, I'm thinking, this is absolutely not a good fucking look for Logan. You've done something really fucked up. There's a ton of receipts CoffeeZilla has provided. Ding doink, you're my favorite coin. The best thing you can do, or your best case scenario, really, is try to pin it and blame it on other people. But people will see through that bullshit because you're the one who abandoned it, promoted it, made money off it, and made your fans lose a fuck ton of money. That is just facts. So this tweet, yeah, doesn't look very good. A more serious response is what's needed. We will see though. The comments were full of people like hating on Logan, blasting him. Someone saying, before you blame everything on Eddie Ibanez, a reminder you've been working with Eddie since Coachella in 2019. That's Eddie's business partner, Jason, with you. That's Eddie saying, thanks Logan. That's CryptoZoo community manager, Leah Lawson. In 2019, my man coming with the fucking receipts right here. Keep scamming, bro. Good luck in court. The SEC will be on your back soon. Seems kind of shitty to openly mock all of the people that bought into CryptoZoo. And the memes never disappoint. Since he's behind a green screen, it was easy picking. Here's Logan Paul and CoffeeZilla Studio with... Ah... Uh, we know where these images are from. I made a severe continuous lapse in my judgment with Logan Paul in the room where he made that iconic... Apology video. I mean this shit is just the best. I love seeing people fuck with and clown on Logan Paul But you get the gist the public hate Logan Paul. Coffeezilla quote tweets and replies with Logan pretending he's going to investigate his own scam is the funniest thing this year Can't wait for him to f can't wait for him to find himself innocent <laughs> Like yeah, it looks like that's what's happening. He's gonna investigate CryptoZoo. Imitating CoffeeZilla is just such a bad play, in my opinion. Is Logan Paul actually gonna do like a commentary video back at him, or are we gonna get a full-on podcast? CoffeeZilla then tweets out, underneath that tweet, where have we seen a green screen response like this before? Tweeting a picture of Phase K and scam the kids, I mean save the kids thing they did. My name's Frazier. My name's Jarvis. I'm Tico. I'm Rice I'm Nikon. And I support Save the Kids Token. 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 Logan Paul sees his tweet and replies to CoffeeZilla with a smashed coffee cup. The connotations of that are that he's gonna expose CoffeeZilla or like break him. I don't know what route Logan Paul's trying to go down. If he tries coming at CoffeeZilla rather than rectifying his fucking mistakes and owning up to it, then he's just fucked. He's just completely fucked. Again, the tweets and replies, absolutely hating on Logan. Barely any likes on that tweet for him. This is more broken than your promises about CryptoZoo. Why not actually speak to him before he dropped the three videos? Logan got owned by CoffeeZilla. You're handling this in the worst way possible. Might as well admit it at this point. You going to try and sell this picture too for money? That picture has more value than them fucking eggs that don't work. CoffeeZilla also replied to Logan Paul's original tweet of the green screen, looking like a fucking twat, with, did you borrow that green screen from someone? Again, referencing Phase K. Save the kids. CoffeeZilla is just going at Logan. The tension is rising. This is great stuff, to be honest. It's rising. We've got Logan Paul's video on the way. Subscribe to this channel. I'm going to cover it when it comes out. Break it down. And while we're here, let's speculate. What do you guys think Logan Paul will say in his response? Will he A, blame it on someone else? Will he B, and very unlikely, take accountability for his actions, maybe even refund the customers? Or C, will he shit his pants, cry and vomit all at the same time? Let me know what you think down below. Comment which one. Leave a comment. Helps the algorithm. Leave a like on the video if you enjoyed. All the coverage coming at you. I think this will be my last video for New Year's. So, Happy New Year, everyone. I'll see you very shortly. Stay safe. 
Have a great New Year's. Hope you're spending it with friends, family, or whoever you are. Even if it's on your own, it's just another day. And yeah, that is it. Until next time, fuck off.